done. What a fool you are. You cannot kill me. I am eternal. Merkel, Lord of Bones, I am here. I am ready. I am yours. Seriously? Am I gonna fight a god? Shit. Okay, let's see. The apostle excludes the god of this unholy wield and bone chills all nearby creatures. So I shouldn't be nearby. Okay, that's good. Uh, Astarian, buddy, you really need to be up and ready. Ooh. Oh wow. Don't go there! This guy is still... <sighs> yeah, you come here, buddy. All right, so we will use what was that guardian of faith? No, not that one. Uh, wasn't there a ah this one? Beacon of hope. Your allies will regain maximum hit points possible when hit. So I'll do this and then do this. When hit points, they also gain advantage. Okay, so let's do. Uh, go closer. Uh, she can't be healed right now, right? So that's fine. But let's do Beacon of Hope. And then we'll do... Alright. Oh, maximum from that dice roll. Okay, I thought it would be... That would be really good, right? If that was the case. Moonbeam? What's the moonbeam? Yeah. Creature is engulfed by ghastly fame. Okay, on a successful save, the creatures still take half damage. So that's nice. If I go here. Have you recite their demise? Alright, 
170. Let's finish this. here yeah all right so fly to here a high defense I mean <sighs> hold resistance necrotic resistance and has a poison immunity what else I can do other than this right okay she needs to be healed I wish she would come down Okay. Blood comes easy these days. One life to my life. Suspect. Ooh. Well, there's this guy. All right, so let's see. Yeah, let's just do this. Okay, nice. And then let's do kill him. All right. All right, so... We can do There's this incubating one Let's just kill him So he has mental fatigue What does mental fatigue do again? Just the penalty right? Yeah penalty right So 54 Kill hit This Nice Ah Flame strike, I guess I can do, but it has high defense. Uh, or lightning, let's do that. Woo!
My lord, hear me. Nothing. I am forsaken. You. You have no idea what you've done. Uh, Isabel. Ooh. Whoa, whoa, whoa. No. No. We pick our way toward our fates. Unleashed. You Ooh. have my sword. My fealty. Do what you must. Then we fly this foul place. Nice. God damn. I could sleep for a ten day after that. Ketherick's Netherstone. It's in his armor. Take it. Silver knife. Uh, let's take a short rest, I guess. That helped. death the body is cooling but energy radiates from the stone remarkable truly and now the picture comes together the absolute is neither god nor man it is the elder brain you saw held mm. here by those three against its will the crown it wears controls it, and these stones control the crown. It has been dominated. I see. To master an elder brain, to subdue it. Our enemies are formidable. Hmm. Okay. A temporary reprieve, but a welcome one. With a brain on its way to the city, its influence here is weakened. What are these stones? The crown's markings suggest it was forged in Netheril, an ancient empire whose mastery over magic rivaled that of the gods. It is a crown of domination. The stones were taken from its crest. They are nether stones, imbued with the ability to control the wearer of the crown. The crown's netherese magic must be the true source of the parasite's abilities. This must be what elevates their potential. And it must be the reason nobody could heal you. If the crown can do this to the parasite, I dare not imagine what it is doing to the brain. Netherese. These chosen are powerful indeed to have such magic in their command. One of them I know, Lord Enver Gortash, an arms dealer and a slaver. A worshipper of Bane, the god of tyranny. The other is a mystery to me. But the way she spoke, it is most likely she follows Baal, god of murder. Ketherick was a follower of Merkel, which means the Absolute is a front for the gods of death, and our enemies are the chosen of the dead three. Okay. Bane, Baal, and Merkel. The Tyrant, the Assassin, and the Necromancer. They are known to pick from their most devout followers, a Chosen, granting them incredible powers. Each one alone would be a formidable enemy. But working together and controlling an Elder Brain, I dare not imagine what they might achieve. What do we do now? 
We prepare for the fight of our lives, and the lives of everyone in Faerun. The army of the Absolute is marching on Baldur's Gate. Within the city, an elder brain, brimming with power, ready to turn everyone within its reach into mind flayers. All it needs is an order, an order the Death God's Chosen are on the cusp of giving. We must wrest control of the brain from the Chosen before that happens. We must take their stones. All right. Our chances of success are slim, but we must not fail. If we fail, everything ends. I will be your shield, but you must be the sword. And when the chance comes to strike, you must take it, for there may only be one chance. <laughs> Patrick's Warhammer. Okay. Reaper's Embrace. Magical plate. All incoming damage is reduced by two. When activated, you can't be moved against your will or by any spell or action, but have disadvantage on dexterity saving throw. Disadvantage on stealth checks. Hall of the Dead. Patrick Seal. Arcane Enchantment. You gain plus one bonus to spell save DC and spell attack rolls. Okay. Speak with undead doesn't work. Portal to surface. So that's nice. I've been thinking on what you learned below. If you've got your breath, we ought to discuss our next steps. Come, there are important matters to discuss. <laughs> I can't help but feel like I've been fumbling in the dark for too long. And I've just had a lit torch thrust into my hands. The crown! The one the Elder Brain was wearing. Netherese magic. So pure, so complete. I didn't even recognize it at first. Most Netherese artifacts contain only the faintest amount of their former power. The ghost of an echo of a memory. That crown was different. Uh-huh. I can't fathom how such a wonder survived. Surely everything of its ilk was destroyed along with Netheril itself, but... No matter. It exists. I must learn more of it. Okay. That crown sits on a gargantuan elder brain bent on destroying us and everything we hold dear. Understanding its true nature might unlock the means of our victory. We need to learn more about what we saw. An artifact as powerful as that crown must have been documented somewhere. As luck would have it, we'll soon find ourselves near one of the finest book collections this side of Candlekeep. Sorcerer's Sundries. I need to go there and learn all I can. Sorcerer's Sundries, okay. Ha! Sorcerer's Sundries is no mere trading post. It's been serving the arcane community for centuries. Their collection of rare tomes is unparalleled. I mean, nethery texts are hardly commonplace, but I'm certain they'll have one or two stashed away. You'll have to forgive my eagerness, but if my suspicions prove to hold water, this could be the answer to all our problems. Okay. All right. So what did he good. say? A curse lifted. The dead three allied once more. The balance shifts. There are depths to this alliance yet unplumbed. Consider, mortal. Do illithids possess souls? Probably not. No. Nor canst thou count mind flares among them. Okay. Yet, the three amass an illithid army void of apostolic souls that could imbue them with power. 
A flock without souls? Yet to what end, mortal? This is the question thou must come to answer. Until such time, be availed of my services. Yes, Bane, Lord of Darkness. Baal, Lord of Murder. Merkel, Lord of Bones. Once mm. judged, ascended, then vanquished as one and as three. The Alliance is reforged, mortal. The planes thus quake, and the gods shudder. Okay. Where matters of balance are concerned, I am eternally cold. No. <laughs> When Duke Elton formed the Flaming Fist, he sought out people of courage and honor to fill its ranks. You saved Daniel, lifted the curse, and killed an immortal. It's safe to say you'd have been recruited in an instant. Hmm. Gruff and intimidating, but he had the courage of Ten men, and a love for Baldur's Gate few could match. I don't know if this Duke Ravenguard is the same, but I will say this. The Flaming Fist are the cornerstone of the city, and the Dukes are its foundation. I hope you can save him, for the good of Baldur's Gate. <laughs> Thank you, but look at me. I am a relic. A glyph besides. Nathaniel should have someone here when he wakes up. It's the least I can do. I don't think there will be an aft. The truth is, the shadow fell. Broke some butt. Because of you, Nathaniel is safe. Because of you, I could help him. All right. I guess. You did it. Catherick Thorne is no more. The Shadow's grip is broken. Soon, the land shall heal. I would agree. But patience is needed. Nature moves at its own pace. And bestows its bounty when it sees fit. Give it time. A reward shall come to you when you need it most. All right. Helen. Isabel. I'm here. And and so are you. And my father, he he can't hurt us any longer. Mm. I dreamt every night that you'd come back to me. She's like a tower, man. <laughs> Somehow it was all so, a so tall. dawn would undo. I had no dreams at all. Nothing but darkness. And when I woke, my father said you were dead. His soul was poisoned by the god of death. His sick devotion ruined him. But for all his sins, he brought you back to me. Are you all right? I will be. And you? In this moment, I want for nothing. Whoa, 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 whoa. 
Everybody is around, okay? <laughs> oh, there you are. This is Aelin. Aelin, this is... Oh, but we have met. This is the soldier that freed me most valiantly from the Shadowfell. They watched my boot crush the very brain of villainy. <laughs> and fought well against your changed father. May he rest in peace at last, now that he's dead. I have more to thank you for than I knew. And we have much to discuss. Perhaps we could join you in your camp later? Sure. We look forward to it. You there, Sharon. By the fires of your camp's hearth, we will discuss all we must. I'll be ready. Whatever you have to say had better be worth your life. Now you will leave us. We must take succor in one another's bodies and words. Aelin! We'll see you later. <laughs> We've lasted long. Be gone! I must admire Isabel's fulsome beauty away from prying eyes. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Somebody is downstairs. Quartermaster Tali. Ah, okay, okay. Got it. Uh, Our enemies spread like rub rot. Treat one patch, and two more bloom in its place. An elder brain, bound by lost Netherese magic, with servants of the dead three holding the chain. <laughs> Reminds me of old times. Aren't you? It is good to savor the moment of victory. But pace yourself. Our fight is just beginning. When we met, I was licking my wounds. An old bear with her leg caught in the hunter's snare. Okay. Now I've slipped free of the trap and rediscovered my claws. It's time for me to hunt my prey. You have a nether stone, and you're on the scent of two more. These Chosen have reason to fear you, and I would like to be at your side when you confront them. Absolutely. Glad to be there. Falling foul of Ketherick convinced me that my grand adventures were behind me. That even if I survived, I should hang up my blades. But you convinced me otherwise. We ventured into darkness together. Now we've come out the other side. I'd say I'm feeling a little refreshed. Okay. When we reach Baldur's Gate, there will be even darker paths to tread. I will follow you wherever they lead. How does it compare to a shadow cursed inn? With the Absolute's army gone, the Risen Road should be clear. We can follow it all the way to Baldur's Gate. There's a Harper's safe house in Worms Crossing. Dentalan's Dancing Axe. We do well to check in with them before entering the city proper. Beyond that, okay. our course is yours to set. I can recall how to take orders as well as give them. <laughs> all right, the High Harper. Fine. So you're we saying leave the heart of the absolute alive. Thanks to you. You did well to defeat Ketherick. But Ketherick was only the first to fall. There are many more battles ahead, and they will not be so easily won. You will need allies. Jahira's wisdom will be an asset to you on the journey ahead. Her harpers, too. Okay. Halsin's strength and loyalty will bolster you in times of need. But if we are to succeed, we will need others. Who? Cool. 
Even if the buildings are demolished, there are always survivors. There are always those who will fight. Baldur's Gate may not know it yet, but its fate is bound to ours. Seek on its streets those whose purpose aligns with our own, and invite them to our cause. Together, we will put an end to the Absolute. The cho So, let me see. Get Gortas's Nether Stone. Get Orin's Nether Stone. Gather your allies. The housing is grateful for our help. It's nice. Find the night song. Okay, find mole. So that's fine. The high harper. Jahira joined our party. We should head to Baldur's Gate. Okay, fine. Defeat Catholic Throne. Find a cure. This is a far greater plot than we had imagined. Our spearheaded by the chosen of the dead three and involving an adder brain. Alright, fine. Find Zevlar is done. Okay, that's good. 